with the area's certified, most accurate forecast six years in a row. Meteorologist Chad Raithlisberger. Well, things were fairly quiet through much of the Sunday, but now a mix of rain and snow is arriving as we head into the overnight. Right now, as we look outside on our Storm Team 5 Skyview camera, powered by Pella windows and doors, Appleton dry roads at the moment, 34 degrees. We are looking at uh, Oshkosh also at 34 degrees. Notice the roads looking a little wet now as some of this snow and also some rain begins to move in from the south and west. Currently in Green Bay, 35 degrees, feels like 26 with an east to southeast wind at 13 miles an hour. These winds will be awfully strong later on tonight and throughout at least the first half of the day on Monday. Rain and snow becoming a little more likely through the overnight temperatures will likely start to warm over the next several hours as well as these winds pick up out of the southeast at around 15 to 25 miles an hour. Right now 32 with some light snow being reported in Clintonville. 33 and some light snow in Wapaka as well. 20s further off to the north. Mid 30s right along the lakeshore and in Fond du Lac. Look at these winds starting to increase out of the southeast at around 10 to 20 miles an hour. And as we look at future casts, these winds continuing to be quite gusty through the overnight and into the early morning on Monday. Here's 1 o'clock Monday morning. These winds 15 to 25 miles an hour with higher gusts right along the lake shore. Even into the late morning on Monday, winds still likely gusting to around 40 as we uh, head through the morning hours on Monday, especially closer to the Lake Michigan shoreline. And with the warm weather that we have had here recently, the ice has been breaking up across the bay and Lake Winnebago. And with these strong winds, could have some ice shoves along the western shores of the bay and Lake Winnebago. So something to be aware of uh, throughout the night tonight and into the day on Monday. All right, much of what you see here on the radar in terms of the snow, not hitting the ground just yet. This is evaporating just a few thousand feet off the ground, but we do have the snow falling across central Wisconsin. Like I mentioned, areas around Wapaka and Watoma are reporting some light snow showers, even some light rain as you head towards Fond du Lac. But over the next several hours, this will continue to expand in coverage and we will start to see that snow begin to reach the ground. Now we do have some advisories and warnings across the area. Winter weather advisory for all the areas shaded in purple. This runs into the mid to late morning on Monday. Winter storm warnings for these pink shaded counties. That does include northern Ocano, northern Marinette, as well as Forest and Florence counties. That goes until noon for your Monday. Otherwise, we do have more rain and a wintry mix off to the south and west, all making its way into northeastern Wisconsin. So as we look at future casts into the early morning hours on Monday, here's 5 o'clock. Notice that rain snow line right around Green Bay. Rain further off to the south, more snow further off to the north. That rain snow line continues to move northward throughout the mid-morning on Monday. Many areas around Green Bay and the Fox City is looking at rain, still snow further off to the north. And this rain will eventually start to come to an end as we head into the mid to late afternoon tomorrow. Green Bay to the south, very little slushy inch of accumulation expected. But you get north of Green Bay, and especially closer to, to uh, the Wisconsin UP border, some areas could pick up upwards of six inches of that wet, heavy snow. So your forecast for tonight. A mix of rain and snow, and we're looking at windy conditions as well. Temperatures in the upper 20s to the north, 30s for Green Bay and the Lakeshore. For your Monday, snow will eventually switch over to all rain by the early afternoon. It'll be windy once again with high temperatures in the upper 30s and lower 40s. Your seven-day planner has another chance for some light snow on Tuesday. Colder weather then arise Wednesday and Thursday with yet another chance for light snow by Friday. If you want morning forecasts, download our free Storm Team 5 weather app that's on the App Store and on Google Play. So not a whole lot of snow expected. It'll be tough to measure as well. It's mm -hmm. going to have a lot of water with it. And with that rain falling, it's going to kind of just compact fairly quickly. So just remember, if you're hitting the roads in the morning, it could be slippery. Yes, it will. All right. Thanks a lot.